Hey there YouTube, I am back with some more Shogun 2 Total War Online multiplayer action. And this is actually a drop-in battle. And for this drop-in battle, I command the Sogo, and my opponent here commands the Chosokabe. So, uh, let's take a look at each army here as I'm moving up. I have six sets of Bo Ashigaru. And you can see them running forward here. I have 10 sets of Yari Ashigaru. So that is a lot of infantry. So let's go up to the line here. We'll move it up a little bit. So that is a lot and a lot of infantry. And finally I have three generals bodyguards. So these guys. And uh, they all have the uh, balloons on their backs. So kind of tough to distinguish the main general. I guess they all take part on morale. Alright, now let's take a look at my opponent's army. He has seven sets of bow, uh, oh actually, he has some bow samurai here. Um, he has one, two, well he has uh, seven units of archers and they are a mixture of bow samurai and bow ashigaru. So he definitely has a huge ranged advantage and not, that's not only because he has a numerical advantage, it's because he has Chosokabe bowmen. And, I mean, Chosokabe get a huge bonus when it's with the ranged component. So, yeah, you're never going to win when it's an even match. And even in this case, he has a numerical superiority. So I'm screwed in the archer department. But then, I do have a slight infantry advantage. Uh, he only has eight sets of Yari Ashigaru. So, these guys right here. And I have two sets more. But um, because of his archers, he could very easily overwhelm my Yari Ashigaru with fire from his archers. So I need to be really careful in this fight. Now for his cav component, he has three sets of light cav. One on his left flank and two on his right. And he, finally he has a general's bodyguard. So, seeing that my archers are losing this fight, just completely getting devastated, I decide to rush forward my Yari Ashigaru, and he made a mistake here. He did not start firing on my uh, Yari Ashigaru here until the last second. So, my Yari Ashigaru are going to get really up in his face before he can do a thing about it. He only gets some shots in right here, and it didn't even kill that many men. So, at this point, I am now right on top of his archers, and he can't do a thing now. So I charge right into his archers. He actually did not uh, call them back, and that would have been a smart thing to do. But uh, he responds by charging in his uh, Yari Ashigaru into my Yari Ashigaru. So he kind of negated the charge of my Yari Ashigaru with his bows, and then he charged in his own Ashigaru. Which, it was a smart idea, but I just have the overwhelming numbers, and that's what you have to factor in. Over here, I have these two units of Yari Ashigaru and Spearwall. So he is going to charge right into my spear wall here. Actually, I take them out to charge myself, and he charges, so it's kind of an even charge. And you can see that there is chaos all along the uh, the battle front here. So you can distinguish our two guys by I am wearing the uh, white, and he's wearing the black color. And it is now that I decide to activate my cavalry or generals section of the battle. And I charge in this general right into the flank of this Yari Ashigaru. And I know that's really dangerous, but I, I felt that I needed to because my flank was starting to collapse. So in response to this, he charges in his two units of light cav right into this sector as well. But that was not the best placement that he could have thrown them in because he just charged right into my Yari Ashigaru as well. So I have my generals close to the battle inspiring my men. This general right here is going to uh, inspire the men to victory. And I also have my bows firing in. I didn't really mean to have them firing in on this unit. I think I meant to have them fight the cav. Or shoot at the cav, I should say. So, look at all my dead archers. And that just tells you how superior the Chosakabe bowmen are. So, that's pretty much the end of this fight. It was, a, it was an interesting battle. I gotta say, um... Drop-in battles can be very, very interesting. I felt that this one was pretty interesting. It had some, you know, odd moments in it with the uh, bow fight, and it was kind of a stalling procedure. It's 
kind of weird fighting an all Ashigaru, fighting with an all Ashigaru army, like all bows and all Yari Ashigaru. I did that like you know the first couple battles on multiplayer, but I'm talking about huge scale, like ten sets of each, and that that's basically what happened here. So it was a pretty messy fight, I guess you could say. So yeah, I I did enjoy it though. It was uh, much different than uh, cla you know other battles that I've had so far. So it's a much different experience. Dropping battles are definitely much different. So yeah, that that is basically the end of the fight. And uh, before the fight ends, I just uh, want to say that um, I've been uploading videos like crazy this weekend. I've uploaded about uh, six videos this weekend, I believe. So yeah, I've been going crazy on videos because I want to get out a bunch of Shogun. And I've started two new campaigns as well. I'm sure you guys have seen those. Started the Hojo and the Oda campaign. So uh, if you guys like that, I definitely suggest you check it out. But I also understand there are many, many people who, uh, you know, prefer multiplayer. And I like both, to be honest. And don't think that because I have two campaigns going that I won't be putting out multiplayer. I will most definitely be doing that, as you guys can see right now. And I actually uh, will bring you guys another video because I haven't been putting out many multiplayer videos recently. So I got another battle to bring you guys. And I will be back to you guys with that fight in just a moment. Alright guys, so I know I said that I would bring you guys another battle, but I actually did not have another battle replay to bring you guys. So uh, I figured I'd just uh, bring you guys something uh, a little bit funny that I saved myself just for fun. It's actually uh, a cool just samurai fight basically that I made out. It's uh, Yari Hero, max upgraded versus a katana hero max upgraded and uh... mine is actually a shimazu katana hero so yeah and his is a th theirs is a date he yari hero so it's a hero fight and uh... you guys want i just figured you guys would like to see it if you don't it's fine you don't have to watch the video anymore but uh... yeah i didn't have another battle replay to bring, bring you guys so yeah sorry about that but here is a uh, yari hero here and uh... this is just a cpu cause I don't think anyone would really do this online. So, yeah, we just have some generals as well, and I'm just going to show you guys some uh, epic slow motion fighting between the samurai here. So I just have it in fast forward until we get into some action. And let's take a close up of these uh, katana hero. And here they're going to start the charge. And they are in bonsai charge mode, so let's watch this as they clash. Bam! And each of these units is obviously a really small unit because they are so elite. But uh, here, uh, yeah, uh, this is a uh, AI thing. The uh, AI general just charged right into that, and uh, so I charged in with my general as well. So let's watch some one-on-one -on -one fighting here. Here's uh, one katana and hero. Let's watch uh, this Katana hero fight this Yari hero. And their horsemen are all in this mess too. Ooh, that Katana hero just took out that horseman though. So, let's see this. It's two against one. Who will win this? Oh, jeez. Almost. Now it's one on one. Ooh. He goes down. Let's watch uh, these guys. Ooh, who will win this one? Hmm. Yeah, I, I just figured you guys would like to see this. This is uh, one of the amazing things about Shogun 2. They really do have some cool fight uh, scenes here. So you can definitely enjoy yourself like this. So it's one against two. Who will win this? Ooh, down. And this is the last guy. And right through the neck. Good night. And he is falling. So I thought you guys would just enjoy that short little clip there. Uh, sorry I didn't have another battle replay to bring you guys, but I'll be back to you guys in the future. See ya.